<laughs> Everyone's looking. I say everyone. Morning, you okay? You, you open up today? Yeah. Yeah, you've been closed for a while. Yeah. But now, now open? Yeah. Good. Now open. Cool, I'll come back and uh, eat. Okay. Okay, cool. Now, come everyone. Welcome. Welcome, I'll be back, my friend. Okay, thank you very much. No problem. Okay, this is Wahin Beach. And I've walked this beach since I've been here every day. Well, apart from yesterday, because the, the sea was really rough yesterday and it was coming right up. But all these little places to my right, they have all been closed. All of them have been closed. And now they're starting to open up today. So I don't know if there's been changes with regards to restrictions. But it's all, it's all pretty good. We're all getting the stock out in here. Let's have a quick look. Hello. Good morning. morning. You're you open today. This is good news. Good. Wahin Beach is open. Awesome. Awesome. So that's good news. Oh, really? Good. Okay. Yes, I see, man. Sweaty cap. Those sunbed guys, they're all out today. It's good. It's good. It's good. They've got their businesses back. All good. All good. So, if, yeah, this is really good because all these places have been closed. Uh, every day that I've walked here, except for yesterday because it was a bit rough. <laughs> uh, and the sea was, it was right, right up. So, this is really good news. Good news for these people. Oh, so, I'm doing my little beach walk, Long Wahin Beach. I, I didn't expect these guys to be open, so that's good. They're getting the menus out. So, hang on, they come. I did see these these guys. Let me show you what I'm walking into. You know, this is the beach. It's a little bit cloudy. It's about eight o'clock. I'm a little bit late out today, as uh, I was doing a bit of video editing in the morning, and that does take a little bit of time. It took a little bit longer than before. So we've got Clint Eastwood on the beach, look. Good morning, and you can rent these horses, or rent them, ah, from here. This, this is just the place, this, that's the main part where all the cars come and park, uh, and that'll lead you to the beach. Uh, yesterday, I managed to get to this part of the beach, which was full of horses, and those pictures will be on my Facebook or my Instagram find them if you're interested in looking at the pictures so I well what I've set out for I've got my little bag with me today and um, like I said I wasn't expecting these places good morning good morning she's got a she's got she looks like an Instagrammer or a YouTube she's got a tripod there which looks very similar to the one I've got that was that was what I was looking at. Not not the. Ah, oh, oh, it's looking good. It's looking good. So I all these. I don't know if my day's going to be not what I planned. Which big trip guys. All these places to my right are all in, inclusive hotels or condominiums, all with pools and stuff, and they're all shut down. I say all shut down. I've tried to get into a few. The security guards, I can't get by them. I've, I've tried, but they're a bit sharp. And, um, but I did find one the other day. So look, this is, this is what you've got to like, expect, walking along the beach. Got bloody holes, <laughs> holes. Kids have been digging holes along the beach because I'm walking along looking at the camera. Um, so I avoided that one. So if I do... <laughs> Being a tiny if I fall over, right? Uh, so let's try and see if we can get into this one. Let's see, because they've got swimming pools and the sea at the moment is full of jellyfish. I don't want to get stung. Where all these little inclusive places, they've all got pools. Now I've wandered into this one. There's a couple of people to my left. And they haven't pulled me up yet. And you see these little restaurant areas, 
and all this decadent. They're cool places to hang out, but they are, uh, they're for residents only. No diving in the pool, but what a cool little pool. We like these places and I'd like, I would like to find one. Oh, that's really deep there. Um, uh, it's a cool place. I haven't been kicked out yet. So I might come back to this one. I brought my little bag with me. Got my trunks in the back. And a pack up. Uh, which, I'll walk along a bit more. See if I can find a more exclusive place to myself. Wow. And the weather does look like it is really going to break today. Looking right out, it looks really, really clear. So this sun will probably break through the clouds. We'll have summer in Wahin. It's not bad. The, the, the beach is actually relatively clean. Nice deep sand, which is what I like to walk on. Or we've got the solid sand. Whatever you like. And I can see the when I'm looking right ahead, you can see the air is a lot clearer. Uh, you know, it's not so humid, the air isn't so well you can see it's clearer because you know I can see a lot further than what I could uh, on previous days. Well, what is it, the horse rides, they're more like nags rather than little horses, we call them nags. Yeah, it's like donkey rides back at Yarmouth in the, in the 70s, stuff I grew up with. It's always quite pleasing to see. Oh, someone's got his tent there. No, you're alright mate. I can ride all keep back. Nah, I ain't getting on that fucking old nag riding up there. Check this guy out. He's got the full kit, look. Serious. <laughs> cool people man, they're just too cool for their own good. Oh. Starting. That, that, that is getting quite warm. I predict today is going to be a typical hot Thailand day. Now, <laughs> this is all locked up. I don't know. I'll put these on because it's burning my eyes. I'm so, I don't actually like wearing sunglasses when I'm talking. It, it, it's only, I like to see people's eyes. So I, I will take them off, but it's getting a bit bright. Private property, no entry. <laughs> Where I come from, when I see that, that's like try and break. I see a sign. I was like, see if you can get in, Mr. King. That's what I see. Yeah, I know what it says, but that says something totally different to me. That says, cop. See if you can get in here. Um, so there's the second bit. It's locked. Can't get me fucking out. Look. Cut. I can't. Disappointing. Do I bounce over the fence? Let's keep going, I'm sure. I'm sure, I'm sure I'll find one that's open. I can get in. Perhaps. But that was, I like that private property because they're probably not here. You know, they're probably in Bangkok. These would probably be their second homes. Another one here. There's <laughs> a few Thai people in front of me, they're probably frowning upon the, the Englishman. Fair dues. Can I nip one part one? Wow, 
was open for an infinity pool. Okay, I'll come in. See how far we can push this. I might be able to get a free breakfast. I don't know. Looks like a lot of tired people. Oh man, look. Infinity pool. It's just what I want. These places are quite cool places if you're a bit upmarket. And you go, oh, look at there, look, you can lounge in there and feel like you're, I don't know, like you've made it, I guess. And people do, they lay there, they've probably, they've probably got a load of gold around and the Rolex watches, they've probably got the, they've probably got it all going on, like they probably, the rap stars would probably it come there, like Jay Z and all people like that, they probably like that, they love all that. Load of ladies around them, living the dream. Don't really do it for me, but we'll see. I've got to sit down. I'll sit down and see what happens. Why did I uh, there's no one wearing masks. Where are they? I'll tell you what. No smoking. Oh, look, eat. Right, this is the thing, all these rich people here, right, all that, and then you've got this stinky, stinky, unperforated, that ain't clean, it's not getting oxygenated, and that, that's just at the side of where those people are eating. Now, they don't notice stuff like that, you know, I do, it's the detail. I'll just put you on pause for a sec, with a mask up, and see if I can get in and have a free breakfast. I don't have to wear mask up. <laughs> oh man, let's see if we can get in. We might ask for a room number. We'll see. I might have to. Is that okay? I'll stay in there for a second and see if I'll get pulled up. If not, I'm going to help myself to breakfast. <laughs> Fucking rude not to. Uh, yeah. They've they got crash sorts, they've got all sorts here, man. I just need to find a plate. Where are the plates? Oh, there, look. Let's have a look and see what's on the menu. So you've got hot eggs. Does she now get her eggs? The chef's here, look. Swaddy cap. Oh, he's cooking the eggs. It's okay to film, yeah? Oh, Do you have an yes. Oh, awesome. I'm okay for eggs, thank you. But he's got bacon, eggs. He's got it all going on in here. Omelet. Ladies are making coffee. Look, this is really good. Really good. I'm gonna have a little walk around, and I think I'm gonna treat myself. Excuse me. I think I'm a guest. So I'll grab a little plate. There's cornflakes there. There's a cheese board. There's all sorts of stuff, fresh salad, some stir-fried rice, a sweaty cap, warm croissants, cold croissants. Let's have a few croissants. Are you dears, Rodney? Are you dears? If we get pulled up, we get pulled up, don't I? We'll try one of them. We'll try one of them. <gasps> almonds, I shouldn't really eat almonds, but one will do. And... I'm going to have, I don't know, I'm going to have another one of them. That, I don't know. That's my breakfast sorted. So we'll just go and sit on the veranda and follow this girl out there. Up on cap. It's absolutely superb. I've got a seat over here. Hello. So glad I booked into this hotel and, and, and not the other ones. And uh, we'll give these croissants a go. You okay? Uh, two one three. Two one three. Yes, Mr. King. No, I'm fine. Thank you very much. Cool. Cup and cup. You fucking dares, man. So I took the room number. I'm going to eat this really quick and go back on the beach. 
so you're going to go and check. Mmm. That's really good. I keep this running because I'm going to get evicted any minute, aren't I? You're going to come back. I see, you know. Put on pause. Excuse me. I've got two blokes looking at me from opposite. I think they'll try to weigh me up. But I just want to show you the view. Look. Fantastic. Well, it was a really, really nice view. It's a good breakfast. I'm nearly done. Now I'm not going to walk out. Hopefully. So guys just come over. <laughs> Check me we're off my room number. I hope I don't get arrested. So I'm off out. ASAP. She's gone to check my room number. No perception. <laughs> Things I'll do for you guys, you know. Let me see if I can get out. <laughs> Oh, nerve-wracking stuff, right? Uh, we'll see if I get <laughs> check, checked out. Oh, and the sea, it's really getting warm now. It's getting really warm. The sea's breaking. <laughs> God, man. Things I do for you bloody guys, mate. I just hope I can get back on the beach. And then like <laughs> that's funny. Oh man, it's so hot. Whoosh! Okay. Oh. <laughs> Can you believe what I've just done? Fucking hell man. I hope I don't get chased or back. I like walk back a different way, but you know what? Oh. Oh, that was quite funny, quite cool. Fucking <laughs> hell, and I, that happened, I filmed it, I done it. Didn't make it up. I didn't plan to do that. Just opportunity. <laughs> so, <coughs> I've got this subconscious, mate. I hope I don't get me into trouble. It just tells me to do stuff. You can't do that, can't see if you can get away with doing that. You know what? If you don't try, you don't know. Oh. Okay, I thought, thought that weren't recording for a minute. I thought, ah, oh, I've been gutted by the court that on tape. Gutted, so There's no one coming. <laughs> you got away with it. Fucking done it. <laughs> All in a day's vlog, right? All in a day's vlog. No one chased me down the beach, they're the police about. I like to get rid of this shirt. I'll have to take my shirt off, just in case. But over here, I just heard this funny sound. A nice beach, sea behind me, all calming down. Clouds are clearing, bright blue skies. But this strange noise I've been drawn to. What's going on here? These. Yeah, that. That geese. Look at all them pending there, man. Now geese, as you probably guessed, are really good guard dogs. But it's not good seeing them all penned in like that. It really isn't. And they are penned in. So I don't know. That's just not good sense. Yeah.
Oh, it's getting warm. I'll get rid of his shirt. And it's called taking precautions. I've had a good day so far. And I want to uh, stay out of jail. <laughs> what a lovely day. I put loads of factor I'm down to factor 30. Now I run out of factor 50. So hopefully my skin will handle what well, you know, handle a bit of sun without like getting, you know, bursting into flames as such. But I'm still still want to have a little sit down by a pool somewhere. Terrible. Cautiously, it's all locked up. All of it. All of it. There's no swimming pool. It's a disappointment. I think it's someone's house. Well, there's a car. There. <laughs> okay. Right guys, we've got to wrap this up. That was the Wild Hin <laughs> Beach Walk sneaking in on all inclusive. And I didn't have that on my agenda. I actually, do you know what? There's some steps here. I'm going to sit here. I'm going to sit here. I'm going to finish this. Oh, excuse me, just get this off. I've got a few things I'd like to share with you before I call this vlog. <laughs> it's so close. I find myself amused, and I do, I do, I, like, I didn't plan to go and do that, that just, opportunity, I'm a pure opportunity, as you probably guessed, opportunity presented itself, and I took full advantage of it, I really did, but I have in my bag, I do have, I've got the masks, keep a few masks in there to keep people happy, and I did, I actually did, look, I brought a pack up with me, which I'm about ready to eat, Carrots. Oh, come on, are we there? There we are. Camera, camera screen keep going up. So they're good for your vitamin, your vitamin A. I've got these little, what look like courgettes, but they're um. Like little cucumbers, really good. All this crunchy stuff, I really like it, really good. And to top it off, I brought, you see my fingers, but well, it's so yellow. I, in the market, I can't find it. I actually peeled a bit back home before I brought it out. I lost it. Come on, where are you? Here it is. Right, here's what it looks like with the peel on. Right, that's 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 shimmery. It's got so much pigment in it. Look, you touch it, the skin goes bright yellow. So I have to eat that with a bit of carrot. I really like stuff like that, raw. Raw veggies, really good for you. And what that'll do, it'll keep your blood flowing and that turmeric is like pure medicine. That will unclog your arteries, uh, which is really good. Really good for you. So I'm gonna sit here, like I said, I've had the croissants for breakfast. And I've got to sit here and eat my crunchy stuff. So I get plenty of goodness in me, because like I said, I am walking a hell of a lot. And the food, the food doesn't have a lot of substance to it, you know, so that's why I've been to the market, I've got my carrots and, and, and stuff like that, I buy eggs, which I'd run out of, I usually boil them in my kettle every morning, uh, which I have with my cappuccinos before I come out. 
And that is it. So I've got that in my bag. Got me a little bit of uh, emergency sun cream. A few other things, SD cards. Trunks, in case I find a pool. See, that was me today. I've come out, I thought, right, I've got my trunks. I've got all that. There's a few other little things I've got in here. So I say, a lot of Thai people get really nippy. So if they get really horrible with me, I've got these with me, look. Little bags of stink bombs. I just drop a few of them. And I've also got, yeah, uh, some air plugs in here. And the other thing I've got, which you guys are find amusing, that most Thai people, if you give them, if you give them a chance, they're like, we've got this saying back home, give them enough rope, they'll hang themselves. Now that's equivalent to people back home, but Thai people, give them a bit of cotton, and they'll fucking, they'll find a way to hang themselves with that. So I've got that, for, for me to be <laughs> Mr. Hand of Thai people, yeah, son. Go, go and have that, go and do your, go and do your work, you know. So there's a few things in there, and also I've got, I've got my little mascot with me, you know. I tend to put him somewhere. I ain't taking any little pictures of him, but that's, that's basically me. I, that, that's me in a fucking nutshell. That's a Cheshire cat, by the way. <laughs> so that's me, I entertain myself, and I've been entertaining you guys. And that, that concludes this morning's vlog. So guys, hope you enjoyed that, and I hope you have a bloody good day. Because I know I am. All the best.